Well, getting around this summer just got harder for tens of thousands of people in San Francisco. A heavily used Muni tunnel is closed for the next two months. Muni trains stopped running through the Twin Peaks tunnel today, and that means there's no passenger service between Castro and West Portal. And that's where KPX 5's Susie Steimel is right now. Susie. Well, Juliet, Muni's director of transit tells me this work will make for a smoother, safer, and quieter commute. But for now, they're just asking the general public to be patient. Until the end of summer, the only things rolling in and out of the 100 year old Twin Peaks tunnel are construction crews. SFMTA is spending $40 million on repairing two miles of track, closing West Portal Station to Castro Market Station for two full months. But clearly, when we get this work all done, it'll be safer, smoother, quieter. And when you add the new trains into it, it's a, it will be a major upgrade. John Haley, the director of transit for SFMTA, says the repairs are long overdue. When construction wraps up August 24th, trains will be able to travel at their design speed of 55 miles per hour, something they cannot safely do right now. If you did it now, if we went 55 miles an hour, uh, your fillings would rattle in your teeth. Uh, it would be an uncomfortable ride. And he just delays like an extra 20, 30 minutes to my daily commute to work. Muni riders like D. Zachary Summons are being redirected above ground to take one of three buses, which will slow down the entire system. You take a couple of buses off one line, uh, another off others, so the whole system is impacted to some degree. If you just take a deep breath, we're going to help you get where you need to get to in a reasonable amount of time. Muni has put in place workers like Ken Jones who will get you onto the right bus. See that group of people over there? Oh, okay. That's where you want to be. Thank you. He says so far, things have been smooth. People were overprepared. They were kind of expecting doomsday. Usually there are about 1,500 train passes that go through this tunnel every single day. Obviously, that will be halted until the end of August. And that is some 50 to 75,000 people daily that are going to be redirected.